Hi everybody, I'm Jay Leno. This is my uh, shop where we do a lot of work. And my shop is all about American-made tools. We try to use American-made stuff exclusively. And this is my uh, latest very cool toy. The thing is really simple to learn. I mean, for us, probably the biggest challenge was to draw the part on a computer. Uh, but that's, it, it's a simple program to learn. We use an auto sketch, and so once you get the hang of that, the rest of the machine is, is easy. I mean, you can train anybody to run this machine. Um, you don't have to be a skilled machinist or some, or even, you know, somebody that runs a CNC machine is, has to have a lot higher skill level than, than you would with a water jet. We're not running it 24 hours a day. You know, we're running it maybe on the average a couple hours a day. So th the use is not as high as somebody in a, in a commercial application. But, but for us, I mean, it's, it's, it's been trouble free. The reliability has been great. Uh, we can make a lot more parts. I mean, it saves us time. We can make a lot better parts. Uh, and and as, as the time goes on, we seem to develop more need for it. You know, all, all the time we're coming up with things, hey, we can do this on the water jet instead of some other way. Uh, so it does save us a lot of time and, and we can produce better parts. A lot of our parts are, are one-offs, yet the, the computer stores the part and like six months later you go, hey, I need another one of those. You just bring it up, cut another one, you're done. So once it's in the computer, it, it's, it's a matter of minutes who cuts you another piece. Most yeah. of our parts are, are one of a kind. Uh, we've just cut some uh, main bearing caps for, for a racing engine that our engine builder needs. And we've cut about 150 of those. Uh, they're like inch and 3 16 steel. So that's probably the biggest like production run that we've run. Other, other than that, it's like one, two, three of them maybe. Once we got this machine, word got out that, that we have it. All kinds of people came out of the woodwork and said, hey, can you do this for me or can you do that for me? And I said, well, you know, we're not doing any outside work. But if I had a machine like that, I'd be in business instantly. Because there is a, there's a large need for people cutting, doing this kind of work. And I, I think if you had a machine like that set up in your garage, you're in business. It's just the, the versatility of the machine, the, the, the things you can do with it that that would just be a nightmare to do otherwise. Uh, for our jet car, we've been cutting some aluminum honeycomb. And, and cutting a honeycomb without a water jet is just, if you try a saber saw, it just tears it up. Uh, you know, I, d I really don't see a good way to cut honeycomb without a water jet. And so we've been doing a lot of that with it. And, and I mean, anything you can think of, you can do with this machine. Well, how cool is that? 